when we talk about cis trans geometric isomers we must know the meaning of isomers isomers are that compounds which has same molecular formula but different arrangement of atom in the space geometrical isomers are that compounds in which the rotation of the carbon carbon double bond is restricted and we have different geometrical isomers let's say if you have the carbon carbon single bond like this in this case you can rotate this single bond but if you have the carbon carbon double bond it is difficult to rotate the carbon carbon double bond and that's why we get two different types of the geometrical isomers so these are cis as well as trans let me write the examples for it so let's say if you have the substituent like chlorine on it and the hydrogen so here also you have chlorine and the hydrogen in this case we have two carbon atoms and we have double bond between this so it means that it is alkene so we can give the name for this compound so we can write like this so we have one two dichloroethene so let me write that one two dichloro dichloroethene we can also write this compound in another way like this so you have carbon carbon double bond so this is chlorine we have hydrogens now here i will write the hydrogen and the chlorine now you can see that the molecular formula of this compound as well as the molecular formula of this compound are same but if you see the chemical properties as well as the physical properties of these two compounds these properties are different here also we can give the name like 1 2 1 2 dichloroethene now here you can see that with respect to carbon carbon double bond this chlorine are present on one side and with respect to this carbon carbon double bond this chlorines are present in opposite side so when you have such type of system in first case that is both the chlorines are on the same side then generally it is known as cis and the meaning of cis in latin so these are the latin words so cis means on same side on the same side so here we can write this compound as a cis cis 1 2 dichloroethene and in this case both the chlorine atoms are present in opposite direction or in opposite side so we may say it as a trans so trans means across trans means across in latin so it means that we have both the chlorine atoms in opposite side so for this compound we can say it as a trans trans 1 2 dichloroethene so now we can have the examples of the cis trans geometrical isomers so like this so you have carbon carbon double bond here you can put as a ch3 here is 
H, so you have CS3 and H. Now if I say that give the IUPC name to this compound, so you may write the numbering to this compound like this. So this is 1, 2, 3 and 4. In this case, when we write the IUPC name, so this will become we have carbon carbon double bond at position 2 so we will get and the total number of the carbon atoms are 4 so this will become but but 2 in now you can see that we can write the geometrical isomer of this compound in this fashion so in this case the cs3 groups are present on the same side so we can write the CS3 group on opposite side. So CS3 and CS3. So you have hydrogen and the hydrogen. Now when we are writing the name of this compound, when methyl groups are present on the same side, we must write it as a cis. Cis but twin. And when methyl groups are present, in opposite side, so we must write it as a trans, trans, but, to in, trans, but, to in. We can generalize this example by putting the functional group like A as well as B. So here you have carbon, carbon, double bond. So here you have different groups like this so i will put in different colors so this is the a we have group like a we have group like a so when both these groups are present in one side then you can see it as a cis now we have the other groups like this so when such type of situation is there, then you can say this as a cis. So let me write that. So this is cis. In another way, if you have the groups like this, let me write that. So if you have the A group over here, and the other group that is A is in opposite side and the B is present again like this. So such type of situation is there then you can say these compounds are trans. Now here again just I want to make one more point clear if you have the carbon carbon double bond and with respect to that Instead of having the similar groups like A and B, in some case you may have A, then you may have B, C, and D. It means that when with respect to carbon carbon double bond, if all the groups are different, then in such case, we cannot apply cis and trans naming system. But instead of that, we have to apply E as well as J naming system. And that we will see in the next video.